Hey guys, um, I haven't put anything up in yonks, so I thought I might uh, make a little bit of an update video because I got a package in the mail. Um, a very special package. It's a package I've been um, contemplating purchasing for a long while now. Um, and I thought, hey, yeah, it's uh, let's make a video about it. Just a little unboxing. Um, of yeah whatever whatever's in this mystery package so there's a 50 50 chance that whatever's in here is a little bit thrashed because the box had a bit of a spicy adventure on its way here from japan but you know what let's let's see how we go let's cut away from ourselves uh proper bunny bunning nice etiquette bubble wrap, I'm gonna have tons of fun with that. Alright, so what I have here is um, a camera, if you guys hadn't, hadn't guessed. I might actually zoom this out a little bit, so that you can see as I display it here. Um, I'm, I've lately been wanting to get into medium format a little bit more seriously. Um, at the moment, my favorite medium format camera is my Voigtlander Besser, which is tiny and can slip into my pocket with ease and pops out to look like, like this. And it's nice, but I kind of just wanted something that was ergonomically a little bit easier to just carry around something that looks a little bit more like the proper 6x9 format. So introducing the Mamiya Press. Um, let me see if I can get the back off. So this is the Mamiya Press. It is a 6x9 um, press rangefinder medium format camera. Um, I've got the Super 23 version, which will take, it's around here somewhere, and I'm not sure, exactly sure how to open this, but we'll give it a, uh, right crack, um, which will take a ground glass focusing screen so that I can do large format-esque um, like tilt shifts and whatnot. Um, it comes with a, I think this is a 100 mil, a 100 3.5, which is very similar, a little bit more telephoto than my Voigtlander, so it might be a little bit nicer for um, your close-ups and whatnot. Uh, was it portraits? That's right. That's what I was trying to say. It'd be nice for portraits um, and a lens hood and my battery's just about to run out, so I'm gonna skip to an overhead view and change my battery, boys. So yeah, this is my new Mamiya Press. I'm just, I just might come and sit over next to it. Um, I'm learning this as much as you guys are um, as far as trying to mount the different components. I think I've got two. Line that sucker up, push him over, pull out somehow the, uh, the lens, because the lens itself, oh, no, I actually think that this is how deep it, it feeds. So the um, it's got a coupled rangefinder. So the rangefinder patch is there, and the viewfinder is there, and I'll be able to focus that way. It also takes these six by nine backs, which I plan on getting more of, so that I can use black and white film in conjunction with the color film that I use, and and a handle, which is very similar to my C100. 
Um, Alright, so I've had a little bit more of a play of this bad boy, and I'm very, very happy with the quality. The shutter speeds get a little bit iffy when you get to the lower, the lower end. Also, sorry for the noise. Mum's vacuuming, and the dog does not like it when she vacuums. Um, but yeah, this is the Super 23. Um, yeah, I'm hoping to do a uh, follow-up video soon for you guys because this is one camera that I can see myself carrying around with me everywhere a lot. But yeah, I'll see you later.